Well, if you're watching this, it means we've either caught fish or one of us got struck by lightning in a spectacular fashion. What's going on everybody? My name is Brian. You're watching Angling Anarchy and we are dog fishing today. And for you that would say, hey, why would you fish for dogfish? Those are a trash fish. I say, nay, they are not a trash fish. I think they should be considered a sport fish, quite honestly. They hunt baits. They wake on baits like muskies. They are such a cool fish. And I, I've seen a couple times on Facebook, people say, oh, they're, you know, they, they kill the ecosystem. They're eating all the fish. Again, that's, that's an old wives tale. Um, that's something that you know maybe your grandpa told you your dad told you you know throw them up on shore get rid of them they're they're a trash fish they're absolutely not they are very cool fish they've been around for millions of years they're prehistoric man i mean they they were here long before any of these other fish were so we are giving the doggies a little bit of respect and we are chasing them today because they are fantastic hitters fantastic fighters i've got my buddy lee Talkin of today's angler right over here and in the back mr noah humfeld check out Noah on Madison Angling, Lee of course today's angler, and uh, that's enough yapping. There's a whole lot of YouTubing going on in this boat right now, so uh, we're going to get to fishing. Alright ladies and gents, we're going to get things started here. I have a modified version of the little topwater frog that I like using for dogs. The actual version has the little hook ending right about here. I've added an extra wide gap uh, because these dogs seem to nip at the back end, and we will see if that is able to get them. frog in here these guys are already rolling brian already had somewhat of a kind of a blow up yeah a little i think it was a little bass took a swat at it so that's a good sign there's fish in the area oh 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 oh, 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 oh. the fish what, it's what still sitting it? it was uh it's a dog it's it, a dog it, it, it yep, was no, a dog there you go no hit the yep 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 oh he turned on it didn't he or did he spook no he's I think he just couldn't quite see it. Sure. Oh, he might be on it now. That was definitely a dog. That was a dog, yep. <laughs> I saw the little tail rippling in the back there. <laughs> First doggy. Yep, if they're, if, oh. oh. What's that? That was probably a bass. Freaking hit the water. Oh, there you go. Hooked up. Feels bassy. Bassy? Bassy or a little pikey. Brian was the locator. Oh, yeah. Uh, largy? Nice largy. Brian located. Hey, I'm all about the conversions lately with Robbie the other day. Almost getting that 50 incher on the Death Paws minnow. Whoa, Ooh, that's nice a good one. one. I'll take that. That is not so bad. Oh my gosh, that that's thing a is nice fish, dude. Come here. <laughs> oh, I lost it. I missed it. I missed it. Come here, no. You got a bunch of hooks in your face there. <laughs> dude, that's a chunker. Dude. It's already putting on some mass from the post spawn. There we go. Take that. That's a tall fish. Good looking fish. Cool, cool. Not a doggy. That thing crushed it though. That was cool. Nice fish. Thanks for the location there, buddy. Absolutely. I'll, I'll take a bass. I need to catch something, <laughs> man. All this musky fishing. What's it say for the surface time back there, Noah? 80? <laughs> Whoa! That was a cool bite. That Another bass? Cool bite. I don't know. It's gotta be. I'm gonna say yes. Yep. Yeah. Wow, dude. Just whooped. 
<laughs> of course, now the leader wrapped around the hook. <laughs> no, 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 no. Let's just take that tension off. We got pliers at your knees here if you need one, man. You think that was choked? Look at that hook down all the way. <laughs> Nice boy, that fish is warm too. <laughs> Doggy giant right under me, right here. Look at this. Oh yeah. Look, oh, oh he's gone. He took off. Dude, that was huge. That was a, that was nice a big one. doggy, man. What is happening? I'm over here trying to dig out a popper. Dang. These were smashing some really nice largies, and there's a giant <laughs> dog on there. Uh, Brian's just I'm just hanging. I'm the guide today. Brian's I'm the front dude. of the boat. I'm the guide. But dude, I'm just going to release that thing, and I look down. <laughs> it was right like, there. I'm Gosh. letting the bass go, and there's a high, oh, mid, upper 20 inch doggy sitting right there. <laughs> that I'm not going to catch. Okay. Oh, we'll get them later. All right, so because I just don't want to catch them. Ooh, here we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Is it? <laughs> Dude, big dog, big dog. Is it a dog? Big dog, big dog. I got the net. I got the huge, net. huge, huge. Huge, huge, <laughs> it's huge. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my foot, oh my God. Get him, get him, get him. I yes! Know. Yes! Doggy. Dude! That is my biggest dogfish ever. <laughs> that, bait, oh, she, that bait is down, dude, it is down. Oh, cool. I think it's outside, it's, I, got I think it's under its jaw. Oh, it's bleeding, is it? Yeah. I'll put it right oh. here. Oh my God, I just blew everybody's ears out. <laughs> dude, that is, the big, that is the biggest dogfish I've ever caught in my life. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. Oh my goodness, you guys, that is legitimately my personal best dogfish by a lot. Like, look at the size of this thing. I, I thought it was a big bass the way it hit it. Cause you, I mean, my experience with dogfish is they almost always wake on the bait. This thing just smashed it. It was coming into the boat and I'm like, dude, is that a walleye? And then I saw the fin on top. Anyway, let's take a look and see how big she is. So mouth closed. 27. Pretty much right on at 27. 27 inch doggy, that is my PB. Let's get this big old girl back. So freaking cool, man. I got her. I got her. Doggy. Oh, dog. It's not big though. I've got the net. <laughs> I got it. Okay, got her. Got a little one. Woo! Dude, that's two for two. On, or no. Uh, two for three. Two for three. Although mine's a little bit hard. Okay, I guess I got the pipsqueak here, but just a beautiful animal. For those of you that don't get the dogfish thing, check this out. These things are like muskies, except they're actually eating the bait now. Uh, they often will stalk the bait before they actually touch it. So, very cool. Little barbels, little whiskers on their nose. He's not happy with all this. <laughs> look at that just they're all thin look at that I'll show that really quick look at this they're thin all the way down their whole body how cool what an amazing prehistoric animal and they don't care about when it's hot weather that's the thing you're musky fishing the water temps get over 80 boom it's doggy time I know we're not quite there yet but we'll take this for tonight Yeah, yeah. Oh, they, they just suck at it, man. It. Oh, oh, Lee. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh my gosh, what is happening? Lee just had to try to I wasn't even looking. I mean, it didn't matter because he didn't pull it under anyway. Oh, 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 oh. Another one. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness.
<laughs> the old death roll. <laughs> We've each got a dog in the boat. <laughs> okay, there's another one here. Watch okay. This. We're going to double up. All right, double doggies. Dude, nice. Yes. Nice. Threw down the old power pole. Oh, yeah, power pole down. <laughs> Dude, they're, I've never seen them like this. Yeah. Where they just they are, absolutely bite it. They are fired up, man. Let's see if, oh, let's see when you're ready. You know, like, ordinarily, we would, like, help Ryan with his fish. <laughs> but... <laughs> You just gotta keep casting. You've gotta just keep casting. Whew. Dude, I feel like I'm musky fishing right now. Yeah. My yeah. heart is freaking Way racing. More than <laughs> My heart is freaking racing, dude. Over like two foot fish. <laughs> Okay, there, there's the bait. All right, I'm good. I'm clear. Okay. Oh, geez. My poor frog is a mangled mess. All right. Grab the... All right. Let's see. Down at the bottom here. Got a zoom? No, I usually just go in and out manually. So it's just point and shoot. Yeah. All right. Let's see if I can have this guy. It's got a little bit of the. Oh, this one's got a spot on this side. Is, he, is it on that side? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's a cool little male, man. Awesome fish. I cannot believe how good these things are eating right now. It's just amazing. Yeah, what's the dot look like on that side? Oh, very cool. Look at that. What a shot. That's so cool. It's funny because when, uh, you know, when they've got all their skin on them, I guess, for lack of a better term, the mouths don't look that intimidating. But if you've ever seen a skull of one of these things, they are just wicked looking. They are predators to the max. Been doing it for millions of years. And, uh, yeah, let's... Uh, it's nothing glorious like letting go of a muskie. No. Nope. They just go back. They just go. You just gonna hang out. Is he gonna do the burp? Yep, there's yep, the burp. There's the burp. Ha ha ha. We're each on the board with a dog. I don't think we've ever done that before, Lee. Like no. usually when we come out here and do this, there's it's one right hit there. and miss. I see one. They're every we gotta get back to fishing. Let's do this. All right, folks, if that doesn't make you wanna try dog fishing, uh I was going to say I don't know what will, but I do know what will. Perhaps the next video or two that we have from this wonderful day of chasing bowfin that Lee from Today's Angler and Noah from Madison Angling and I had uh, this past summer. It's just a blast. It's a really fun species to target, especially with topwater. The way they wake on baits is like a muskie. Uh, they're just a fantastic species to chase so i hope you enjoyed this we've got a couple more videos from this day coming and after that we've got musky fishing from iowa that i did recently i'm heading out hopefully to lake st Clair. so there's plenty of stuff coming uh as far as musky fishing goes hopefully a little bit of uh, a different species will tide you over on this channel until then but until then i appreciate every single one of you watching and I will see you on the next video.